What's up, everybody? How's my niggas doing? How's my whiteies doing? How's my Mexicans doing? I hope we're all doing well. This is Sammy Rubes here coming to you live with... Yeah, that was racist as shit. Oh, man. Anyways, in all seriousness, I hope everybody's doing good. In this video, what the hell is that snore? Anyway, in this video today, I'm going to be talking about how to get better at basketball. Yes, the sport we all love and hate at the same time. Thank you, Kevin Durant. But in all seriousness, look, let's get into this. All right, the reality is this. Everything I'm about to tell you, you probably already know, whether subconsciously or consciously, it's somewhere in your brain. You just got to Google it. All right. Now, look, the first secret of Illuminati basketball to getting better at basketball is this. You got to ask yourself this question. What kind of player are you on the court? All right. It's important to know this. Are you a rebounder, a finisher, a scorer? In the words of 2K, a three-point specialist, an all-around player, like pass first, who knows? Look, what kind of player are you? You got to define that. Define what? Anyway, look, you know what I mean. Point is this. You got to know what kind of player you are, so when you go on the court, you know what you bring to the team that you're playing with. So, you got to know what kind of player you are. Some people are like that, some people aren't. Know who you are and perfect your craft. Go to the gym, practice. Look, I wanted to get really good at basketball on my handles. I'm like 6'2", six, 6'3". Six, so, I went to my basement and I started doing like 30 minutes every day of just, just like handles, straight handle drills, stationary, a little bit of movement every now and then, piss my mom off, but who cares, because I pay the bills, no, I don't really pay the bills, but you get the point, all right, so you can't just like wake up in the morning, watch some Kyrie videos, go to the gym, and expect to perfect that move, no, you got to practice, now you could go to the gym and, you know, do that move, but you're probably going to fumble the ball. It's going to go out of, out of bounds and everyone's going to stare at you like you're a little BK slash bitch nigga. So practice is key too. And that leads me to my second point. Practice. All right. See, look, like I said, I went to my basement. I wanted to get handles, man. I wanted to, you know, cross niggas over and make them, you know, fall into a coffin like Kyrie does. You know what I'm saying? So man's have to practice. Now, I was pretty busy. I was going to schools, you know, making YouTube videos, all, all you know, sorts of stuff so i didn't really have time to practice as much as i wanted to so what i did was i told myself hey every day for 10 to 30 minutes i'm gonna go in my basement and i'm gonna just do drills stationary handle drills all right so i went to my basement and i practiced and you know what eventually literally after just a week and a half of practicing now my 10 minutes 30 minutes turned into an hour but i found that yo my handles are way better then I thought, way better. So practice is key, man. Because I was sick of watching the motherfucking videos, <clears throat> all right, watching the goddamn videos of Kyrie crossing niggas, you know, or Chris Paul or Curry crossing niggas. And when I get on the court, I'm trying that shit, and the ball's even flying to, you know, space. Freaking, you know, looking like a fool on the court. So I started that shit. So I'm like, my nigga, nah, I'm going to practice. So I started practicing, and it showed for itself, all right? So practice is key yes i just clapped my hand because i'm really into this practice is key practice man now my third and final tip is have fun yes i cracked my fingers if you can hear that shit anyway have fun have fun like go on the court and experiment i don't want to sound contradicting of course i'm not trying to be contradicting i know it sounds like i am wait you just said i should know what kind of player i am and you know practice on those skills yes you should do that definitely have the fundamentals of your skill laid out but once, at the same time, not even at once, at the same time, have some fun, man. Experiment on the court, you know. Sometimes you'll watch the NBA or you'll watch college ball or even just see a nigga on the court do some shit. And you'll be like, man, that is, like, nowhere close to, like, what you usually do. Because he's experimenting. He's having fun. He's like, nah, yo, I'm going to try. I'm going to try a thing. You know what I'm saying? So have some fun on the court. Experiment. Have fun. Don't limit your potential. Don't limit what you can do or where you can get on the court you know what i mean that sounds so weird but you get my point practice and have fun and now for the last and final step masturbate at least four times a day it's gonna really get your wrist strong you're gonna definitely notice veins popping from your wrist what's gonna which is trust me it's gonna help your shot your form your release um i wanna be the very best like no one ever was 
You're, no, I'm just bullshitting, bro. That's about it, man. Practice, have fun, and know what kind of player you are. Because there's a lot of key fundamentals that come from just perfecting your personal craft. Now, you could watch people and, you know, be like, man, I really like the way Kyrie plays. I really like the way uh, Curry plays or, or whoever on the court. You know what I mean? James Johnson, whatever, or whoever. But you also got to know who you are as a player and what you could bring to a team. And one really quick and extra tip is... Find a move that works for you because there's unstoppable moves, not unstoppable, but really hard to guard moves. The sky hook, you know, the AI crossover, um, the Kyrie shimmy, like you just got to know what moves work for you. C use other people as your motivator and combine moves. But for the most part, know what moves work for you because there's certain moves out there that if you could just perfect or that you even came up with yourself, but you kind of like thrown to the corner because you're so interested in someone else's, that can really change your game. So I found a couple moves myself. Maybe I might, you know, if people actually like this video and share it and shit, I'll actually make a video about the moves that I have that I found worked really great for me. So anyway, that's the video, guys. I hope you like it. Um, subscribe for more. And I could do more videos like this if you guys like it. I could do one about girls and my niggas will adopt. So... Yeah, share the video. Let me know what you think, my niggas. I'm done. No. Peace. By the way, guys, just a quick reminder. Uh, in the making of this video, I literally did not sleep for like 17 hours. So some sentences that I may say might sound weird as shit or might just not make sense, my niggas. So.